Good morning, everybody. We were in Pike Township in an area called New Augusta. You were looking at a train station. Mark Delossi with historic landmarks is about how old, sir? The depot or me? <laughs> <laughs> that, you know what we call that in English? A misplaced modifier. And I'm not doing it again because that's just great. That's just, don't be funnier than me, Mark. How old, how old is, is, is the land? The depot. Yeah. It is probably about 150 years about old, 150 give years or old. take. All right, and I am going to meet the gentleman who now owns it, and it is up for sale. Jim Killen, good morning. Good morning, Good Dick. morning. I showed that picture, and it looks pretty much the same, doesn't it? It does. Yeah. It's all original, and it's in pretty good shape. It is. You're yeah. selling it, but I want to get a little history of the background here. The Purdy sisters, how many were there? There were three Purdy sisters, uh -huh. um, and they were cousins of mine. They were cousins. Yeah. And they lived here, but... Next door. Next door. Not in the station. No, no, not in the station. Yeah. And tell me about this station. What came by here? Oh, there used to be two tracks yeah. uh, here, and now there's only one. Mm -hmm. um, it was a fast freight line as well as a passenger line. I can remember when I was a child, the... James Whipkin Riley used to come through really? here at about 80 miles an hour, and everything had to be anchored in the house. You mean they glued they glued the glasses down and everything, or put, put, putty? A, put a little bit of putty? Is that the, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. so this is one of the last remaining what? One of the last remaining train stations, I suppose. Union Station downtown right. would be the other one, but otherwise, this would be it. Okay. Um, it's a federally uh, recognized historic landmark. Uh, right now, there are people living in the house. We're not going to bother them and go inside. But ultimately, you're going to have to give this up or you're going to sell it. Yeah. And what obligation will the new owner have? Well, they'll have to preserve the exterior in a way that's compatible with uh, the historic right. heritage of the, of the neighborhood. Uh, I believe they can do most anything they want to the interior, but uh, okay. the exterior has to be maintained. Well, here's the deal. I want to get in the interior before anybody messes with it, because sure. you have artifacts in that house that go back how far? Well, the house has been in our family for over 150 years. Uh, they were the first, the Purdy's were the first residents. Okay. And, uh, yeah, they, they go back a Can long way. Can we go way. inside? Sure. Don't miss this. We'll be back.